Move the dictionary. Yeah. But it's not gone. But it's not gone. It's in the resource room. Yeah. I'm not sure where they put it, but I know we still have it. Yeah. But yeah, I, you know, the coffee station, um, people are starting to see it. And we got a new composting service from Evanston, and they come and they, uh, they take it. So it's so completely green. Okay. Um, I guess, well, two more, two more things out of, the, out of the comments that came out of the back, sorry to delay the board meeting, but, um, you know, we do get on occasion, and there seem to be a spate of more comments this last month about uh, cell phone, people on cell phones in places other than the front of the lib library. Um, and I didn't know what, again, maybe as Sarah Beth talked about the signage that we're increasing, is it a matter, do you think, of getting more signage up in places to remind people that they shouldn't be talking by the fireplace in other places where we have the issue? Yeah. I, I don't know, but yeah. Uh, yeah, I hear what you're saying. And I honestly, I don't think it's just cell phones. I mean, we also get complaints about people oh, just, just talking too loud oh, or okay. about kids screaming or, mm -hmm. certainly, that's always a, an issue of noise in the library and trying to balance those needs with some people come here and want more of a social uh, coffee house kind of environment and some people come and they want that real quiet study kind of environment so my perspective is is that we just need to be clear about the zones and that we do have quiet zones and here's where they are and that staff knows how to direct people to the quiet zones when they are seeking that um, as well as here are social zones and one of the reasons we want to do this interior space plan is to make that more clear and so that with computer use too, it would be good to have computers in different areas with the computer pods rather than a whole lab mm -hmm. because some people want to do more collaborative work on computers. Mm -hmm. um, and then they would be able to do that. We would have a social computer area where you just know coming in it would be signed, <laughs> you know, mm -hmm. that if you need that for your computing needs, then you can go to the social computer area. But if you want a very quiet individual computer experience, you could go to the quiet computer area. So I just feel that it's important to acknowledge that Things are changing what people's expectations of the library are, particularly with the millennials coming into the library and using it in different ways. Um, that's an issue with furniture as well. And I noticed this with my own daughter who's 20. <laughs> uh, they don't use desks. They don't use cubicles. They don't use desks because they've grown up their whole lives with computer access and laptops. So um, what happens is, like college students, you know, when they're studying, they want a lounge. They're lounging. They're <laughs> lounging. You know, they want yeah. they want a chair, uh, maybe an ottoman, and their laptop, and certainly some charging. So, but it that sort of thing certainly impacts the library as well because we mm. want to be able to meet the needs of people who do prefer a more traditional desk-based environment, mm. as well as people who bring their laptops and want that kind of environment. As, as far so, as cell phones, are there parts of the library where you can speak on your cell phone? Do we have anything or do you have to be in the mm -hmm. vestibule and is that something that signed it all? Because I've never noticed clear. that. Staff does direct people to the vestibule when they're talking loudly on their cell phones. Okay, they so do. But, but in general you mm -hmm. should, people are, I don't know, because I just don't, I don't, don't see anything about it. I don't even know what the policy is like we don't really have policy it's yeah. procedural more than anything mm -hmm. which is because it's a judgment call like mm -hmm. someone could be just fine on a cell phone if they're not talking too loud or too long right whereas someone else you know they just have a louder voice mm -hmm. or or it just goes on too long and right. so it's it's a judgment call and we rely on patrons to complain about any behavior issue that is disruptive to their own enjoyment of the library. Mm -hmm. So if it's a cell phone or if someone's talking to their neighbor too loud, um, we will mm -hmm. go up and talk to the person and say, hey, we've received a complaint. Mm -hmm. um, and at that point, we would say, hey, did you know you can go talk out in the vestibule? You can be as loud as you like out there or something like that. Right. Or there's, or yeah. there's a collaborative study area you could talk in. Or exactly. Like or if you want if you want to play games on the computer, instead of telling people, no, you can't play games on the mm -hmm. computer with your friend, we, we hopefully will be able to say, yeah, you can, just not here. Mm -hmm. You know, you could do that over in this social computer area, which is, you know, designed for that. Yeah. And again, I'm signing to not my area of expertise, but my thought was 
based on what you just talked about, that um, if there was like a color-coded map of the library, once it's the reconfiguration mm -hmm. is done, it shows in, in a color would designate that this one color, red would be quiet or whatever, and green would be, you know, go ahead and talk, but or something like whatever that is. Right. So, and then if you had a place, if you had signs up saying this is a quiet area, it could say if you want to talk, go to the, you know, on that same sign, tell people where they can go to, to, to talk. And if, if they were in a talkative area and people said you want to be someplace quiet, you could go. Yeah, I like that. I don't know. But that, yeah, just so it would be clearer. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, I think because yeah. my, yeah, my sense was you could only talk in the, in the front lobby on, on the cell phone. I, I, anytime I've gotten a cell phone call, I race out to the, yeah. to the lobby. I mean, you know. I mean, it's it's a matter of you know that push pull of we're all sharing this space yeah, together, exactly, yeah. you know, mm -hmm. and um, trying to communicate that effectively without people feeling badly about what they want to do at the library. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. There's nothing further. Entertain a motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn. I second it. Please adjourn. Okay.